Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank Going Commando. Uh, some things I'd like to mention is you may have seen, you may or may not have seen my explainer video that I'm a, I'm actually about to record it. Um, explaining what happened in episode 2 of Ratchet and Clank, which it, I'm just going to call it Going Commando. Actually, I probably shouldn't. I don't know. Um, if you'll notice, now you can actually see the neon greens in the game and they're not blanked out like they were in the last episode. Um, I don't know how I didn't notice that while I was recording. Like, I should have seen it on my second monitor, but I guess I just didn't notice it because the effect just wasn't as pronounced, which if you're looking for it, it's going to drive you nuts. But I don't feel like I should re-record the episode because it wasn't that big a deal, and plus, it taught me something. I learned new things. Like, even the triangle on that activate vendor symbol, completely blanked out. You can't see any of it. It's it's crazy. And of course you realize how much neon green is in this game. And there's a whole... Just watch the video on it. You've got to see it. You've got to see it. Um, it's why the video came out uh, with all the neon green colors grayed out. And why it's a little bit blurrier than usual. But it taught me so much about chroma key and, ne and, and using a green screen. And it really helps. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to make the video entertaining as well. But anyway, without further delay, we're going to get ourselves on to the next planet over here. I know I need to record Eternal Edge, but I just like this game so much better. Nice. I really, I know I do. Uh, find a way to the Thugs for Less jamming array and win the arena battle. Oh, that's going to be so awesome. Can't wait. Love it. <sighs> Meanwhile, in Megalopolis... May I help you? I said. I just realized if that if that chroma key filter would still were still on, blank, uh, Clank would have freaking gray eyes. It's it's weird. Oh right, your ship is under attack. Shoot down all enemy ships. Fire controls. X fires guns. Secondary weapons. Activate turbo. Barrel roll. Right or left. Straighten ship. Okay. Uh, can I can I get done with that? Can we take that sign off, please? There we go. Hey, these guys are tough. Okay, we got our barrel roll. Straighten ship. You've just collected raritanium. Raritanium can be traded for ship upgrades. Interesting. Enemy ships 14, wave 1. Gotta get these guys. They're all in front of me or behind me. Oh, no, I got you. Dang. There we go. Enemy ships 10. Raritanium. I know I might miss a thing or two, but I'm trying to look, or look out for not getting shot at right now. Oh! shields are going down. Do they refill over time? And how do I get... I need to get these guys in front of me. Okay. Let's see, let's see if we can lock onto them with the non... with the... with the secondary ones. No, forget that. I'm not sure what the sec... Oh! The straighten... the straighten ship button confuses me. Oh, our shields are down. Now we're taking actual damage. Let's go. Let's boost a bit. Oops. Pardon me. And then get them in front of us again. There we go. One ship left. But we're only on the first wave, so that's bad. I don't know if they have any... What do you call it? HP. Whew. I don't even know how many waves there are. Oh no. I don't think we're gonna pass this on the first try. Not with this many enemies. Watch the meteorite. Honestly, if I can get them locked on. 
by the time I get them locked on, it's pointless to fire the secondary weapons. Unfortunately, it looks like this might be it for old Ratchet and Clank. I have taken so much damage. Enemy ships remaining five. I'm trying to use my... Oh, boy. Two, one. Oh, man. I'm taking so much damage here. And I don't see any... Oh! Enemy fighters defeated. Proceeding to the Maktar Nebula. Dang! I barely got that. Wow. I don't know if I was supposed to use boost a lot more. I didn't like to... I didn't want to boost. Didn't want to do it. it seemed like boosting just messed me up. I bet this is my favorite planet because it's got the uh, arena on it. Oh man, let's go! How much money I got? 3,000. Almost 4,000. Okay. So it's almost enough for that, um... I, I believe it's like a shotgun, basically. Like Ratchet and Clank's version of a shotgun. Which is, of course, cartoony as all get out. And I love it! Hang on, I think you can break this thing, too. How do you do the... There we go. Yep. Knew it. Oh, get those. Okay, we don't want to break everything. Let's just continue with the level. Oh, God, I can't wait to get my jet back. Woo! Got that guy. Oh! But he... Oh, okay, he shoots out those little raptors. Clank, I need you. I want my hovercraft, I want my hover pack back. This planet is worth, ooh, watch it. So many bolts. I'm pretty sure the arena is that way, which I want to do that now, really, but I know I, I'm pretty sure I need to do this first. Ooh, they're gonna get, yep, a couple of chunks out of me. That's alright, there's nanotech here. Meh. Nice. Nanotech! The best tech. Nanotech. So yeah. Now I know better about Chroma Key, and all the greens will now show up. I don't know how or why, because you would think that if it was going to be a single layer, it would do it on the first computer, and then the second computer would have that issue, but I guess not. Wait, no, that's the dynamo. We need the tractor beam. Move that out. Now, is there anything else interesting I can do with it? And I... Nah, I can't even get to the top of it, so it's useless. Hang on, what's this? Can I... Can I... No, I can't blast those. That's interesting. Okay, so that's... Zoom. No, I can't blast them. Too far away. Interesting. I think I'm supposed to catch this guy. Or do I use the tractor beam on him? I think I use the tractor beam on him. I need to make him stand right about... Well, okay, well, you don't have to have him stand there for very long. You can just slide him over it. New weapon or gadget? What is this? It makes me nervous. Ah! Oh, it's a bomb! <laughs> That's right. Got you. Got you. That's right. I guess I forgot certain things. That's great. We grab this. It's beeping. Oh no. Whatever we're we gonna do with it, we're gonna need to bring it right over here. Oh boy. Avoid that. Ooh, oh, oh, dag nabbit. That guy's got some serious range. Boy, don't I wish I had the Glove of Doom minions right about now. Hey, look, it looks like you're reloading. Let me help you with that. 
Arena time! Oh, I didn't... Wait, is this the arena? It looks like the arena. I didn't think it was the arena. Dang, I'm missing a lot of nanotech. Oh god, now I gotta go get that tractor beam guy. Hey, you with the... Oh, you're right here. Here, let me help you out, little buddy. Uh... Is that... Oh, right, slingshot. Wow. Okay. Okay, he's in a slingshot. Let's rotate it correctly. Now just back up until it pulls him, and then it should automatically release, or I think I have to manually release it. Yep, it automatically releases. Isn't that awesome? That's cool. That's so cool. Thanks for your help there, little buddy. Ooh. What am I going to get today? Yes! Lotto! <laughs> I can play the slots in this game. Is there a way to... Yes! There's a way to play without destroying it. So how... Oh, it costs 10. Okay. But it gives you 52. Oh my god, I can play slots! I don't need ammo right now. This is gonna be just a video of me doing this then. Ooh, I need nanotech. Can I get nanotech? Bruh, I thought it was about to give me one. Eh, no match. And if you strong hit it... Okay, can you hit it like that to play it? Yeah. Sounds like it's getting faster, doesn't it? I need nanotech. That must be the rarest one to get. Interesting. And of course you can bounce back and forth between the two. Okay, this is the last time. And so, if you just hit it regular, it's fine. But if you do... Wait. The first one got destroyed when I did that. That's crazy. So, is it a glitch? Is this one just eternal? And how many times can you do it? Well, and it, Oh, I bet it explodes if it's all TNT. Like if you get the TNT match. I just keep getting bolts. Oh, TNT time. Yep. Oh, and it makes enemies. Oh. <laughs> nice. Man, did I never do that as a kid? I can't even remember. I don't remember that one being like that. Oh. Dang it. I knew it was there this time, but it still got me. <laughs> God dang it. That's great. Okay, maybe we'll do that part later. What, what are we at? Ah, we're only at 13 minutes. Man, that was fun. So, now I can play slot- Oh my god, there's so many of them. There's so many slot machines. Oh! Dagnabbit, really? He's not even that difficult. I got an idea. I need to strafe for these guys. Which would be... Ah, uh, let's go gravity bomb. Okay, we side strafing? Okay, we're side strafing. Beautiful. Now that's what I'm talking about. Okay, I promise I won't do uh, the, um, the slot machines anymore except just in passing. I'll just hit, I'll just hit each one of them once. Because I, I ain't got all day to sit there in slot machines. I can do that on my own time. Ooh, looks like we got a match. Gravity bomb ammo? Oh no. Okay. It must be full. That's odd. Slot machines! They're the best. Caught you lacking. Uh-oh. Almost caught me lacking. Blaster? Lancer. We do want to level it up. Oh yeah, side strafing is definitely the way to go. This game definitely wants you to side strafe as much as possible. Of course, I remember that, but, you know, we're just here having fun. Oh, I see that TNT. You can't hide that from me. Yes, Lancer ammo. And more bolts. Many more bolts. I just hope I can get to the arena. I want to play that. Okay, that should be everything except for, like, the satellites and other little breakables that I can get, but we don't need to go through all of that. 
Ooh. <laughs> I, I knew that limo. Okay, there's a platform underneath that I wasn't going to die. There we go. And I should be missing two nanotechs, so that should refill one. Yep. Oh, God, I'm just missing more. Uh, am I going this way or that way? I think i got to go this way. And up, up, upsy daisy. And it uh, looks like that dropship's about to drop some enemies. So I'm going to go with the gravity bomb on this one. Ooh, especially with the fact that it's about to do that. Oh, nice. Gotcha, boys. Okay, how many of those soldiers is that ship going to make, I wonder? Nice! Okay, I need to take out that ship. I need an opportunity, though, when they're not firing at me. Is he too far? Dang it. No. Ah. Yeah. I'm sure that's the last one. Yeah. I probably needed a stronger weapon with better range in order to actually take out the ship. It had a set number of enemies that it was able to generate, so I was just supposed to make it through that wave. Which I did. Or we did. Hey, Platinum Bolt! I wonder how you get that one. Now I'm curious. Is it that, um... I wonder, was it that thing I was climbing up on? Uh, it just feels like you gotta have the jetpack for that one. Or at least the hover pack. Yeah, I'm not really too concerned about stuff like that right now. I'll get it all eventually. Take these guys out, out real- Dad, nab it, really? Jump between walls by jumping toward a wall and pressing huh. X again as you hit it. It never ceases to amaze me how easy it is to get, like, just hit on this game and just surprise. You could probably get to that Platinum Bolt from the top of here as well if you had the right pack. Eh, I don't know. That looks a little far. Pop up here. To aim weapons more accurately, press and hold L1. Ooh, watch it. They gonna be coming at me. Watch it! Oh, dear. Oh no, you kidding me? Oh god, I'm gonna get god, aren't I? I wanna make sure that there's nobody else left. I thought I saw, okay. That's nanotech, yes. Let's hit all of these and see if it gives us any nanotech. Oop, nope, don't hit them like that. Come on, nanotech. Hey! It got some- Hey! Nice! It's kind of a cheap method to get nanotech, though. Can't just be doing that all day. Oh, that one exploded. Oh my god. Any game with slots. I completely forgot there were slot machines in this freaking game. This is the best. You know what else has slot machines that they basically outlawed in all the newer ones? Pokemon. If you've ever played the original, like, Nintendo Game Boy Pokemons, like the Game Boy Color and Game Boy stuff like that, original yellow, red, and blue have slot machines. Like, you can play slots, and it's the best. I fucking love slots. Okay. Look, I mean, look! We could get lucky, or we could not get lucky. It's totally random, and it's never ending. Oh, come on, Nanotech, yes! <laughs> we filled up almost our... Bleh. We filled up almost our entire bar off of nothing but pure luck. Joey Wheeler style. I love it. I gotta remember this thing does pause whenever I activate the um, 
weapon select wheel. Yeah! So I need to make advantage of that. Take advantage of that. Oh, that was just one. I should have switched to the Lancer for that one. And then the ship goes away. Yes! We filled up our entire nano Oh, wait, no, we leveled up. That's right. That It does it through that, too. That's so cool. Gotta remember to stray as early and often as possible. Yes! More nanotech. More slots. Well, not slots, but nanotech, yes. And then, ooh, we're so close. Only 5,000 more, and this is, what is this? Enter the battle arena! Heck yeah! We'll probably call the episode there, though, because it's going to run on a little long. Is everyone ready for tonight's mega battle? Yes! If he can make it past all of our gladiators, he'll take on this brand new electrolyzer. Oh, I love it. Woo! Alright, let's do this! All right, let's do this. <laughs> I am way too excited for this. God, I haven't done it in years. Oh. Okay, you wanna play hard. I got you. I really didn't think he had that kind of range. Just sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Ooh. Anytime enemies are grouped up, I'm gonna try to use the gravity bomb. Oop. Uh, maybe right now. Yes, it does help. Ooh, and they can get into the traps too. Oh my god, this is the best! Yes! Ha ha ha! It's more satisfying than it looks, I swear. You gotta try it. You gotta try it. You're now eligible for our championship series. Come back and fight again for big cash prizes. Congratulations, you have earned an electrolyzer. Exit the arena with triangle, or continue fighting to earn bolts. I'm gonna continue fighting on my own time. For now, we're gonna continue with the other path uh, that we um, lost earlier. Yes, that was awesome. Now, the Electrolyzer is this guy. Oh god, I remember some of these are really hard. But the that's much later on. Uh, uh, oh god. You gotta find out which one's coming up next in the sequence and flip the little buttons at the right time. Holy crap. It gets so much more complex later. God, that's cool. And I'm so glad that it's not blanked out because of the chroma key. Anyway, that's another thing that I, uh, a theory that I had that you might have heard of, uh, you might have heard me talk about in uh, Ratchet and Clank regular was, does New Game Plus affect hey, the... this would make a nice souvenir for Clank. Yeah! <laughs> hey! You have no idea what you're involved in. Return to your old galaxy immediately. Oh no, poor little Clank. Or this will happen to you. Or this will happen to you. No. Arg. Oh. I love it. Especially now that I fixed the chroma key thing. God, I just, I'm so all about that. Anyway, uh, what I was saying earlier is that you may have heard me talk about uh, that in another Ratchet & Clank episode from the actual regular game is, I'm pretty sure I can shoot those ships down, but I don't have time for that. A theory I had is, does New Game Plus 
doing it multiple times affect the difficulty of these? Like the electrolyzer things. I'm not sure. Do they get... Oh, God. Why are there so many? I don't remember it being so many at such an early stage. Sometimes I think that's just because of the emulator. Okay, this one. Then this one. Then that one. Then... Oh, my God. Oh, f Oh, God. Oh my god, that one is tough. That is woof. That's one of the starting ones, so I'm hoping that the other ones aren't that much more difficult. My god. Actually, I know. If you want to earn lots of bolts, visit the arena later for more battles. I will. I will. To view missions still available, press select or R3 to access your map. Then press X to open the mission screen. I love that voice, that text voice so much. That blasted. Man, I let him get a hit on me. <laughs> what the heck? Empty nanotech. That's buggy. And I ain't talking about the pirate. We're gonna try to end it off the episode by uh, going through this just last little portion here. Nanotech, nanotech. Yes! So that first time when I hit the first one and it exploded. It must have been because it, it, it hit that specific point where it's just like, nope. Hiya! Hiya! Ooh! Yikes. Are they still behind me? Only one. Man, that cost me two nanotech. <laughs> I'm over here just goofing around trying to take down everything with the wrench. Careful now. Okay, you do have to. Owie! Dag nab it. Okay. So you do have to get the bomb over there, but it's not the one I was thinking of. Really could have used some nanotech at this portion. But we're not gonna. We're gonna. Resist the urge to. Oh god. We're gonna resist the urge to gamble for it. We're gonna take our bomb. We're gonna jump all these platforms. And then we're gonna leave it. Ah! Oh, it doesn't hurt you if you're holding it. What? Okay, I didn't know that. <laughs> it doesn't. It doesn't harm you, if, even if you don't let go of it. So I think we gotta blow. Oh, I know what we gotta do. We gotta take these things out. Still over. Okay, so maybe that first line. These these dots indicate where you should be standing in order to get that hit. Okay, so in between the dots. Again. Now this one's higher, so I'm going to go to the next set of dots. Oh, nope. That was off. Auto. It automatically lets it go once you reach a certain distance. Okay. So the only ones you really have to think about are the bottom ones, since it automatically lets it go once you reach the distance required to hit the top ones. Which, again, don't know why I'm explaining this on a 20-year-old game, but it, it gives me something to talk about, and I like it. Oh, that's got to be it. A little bit over. Uh, uh, just move like one smidge forward. A smidge. A smidge? Yes! <laughs> smidge. Smidge for the win. Oh, God, that's way off. Okay. i got to get myself lined up before I get the thing lined up. Ooh, that's way off. Uh, yeah, that'll do. No. Yes? Ah, close enough. Hey, we got it. Boy, that took forever. And a day. And of course, there's skill points for breaking all of the breakables, lanterns and lamps and everything in this stage, I think. But we're not in it for skill points at the moment. If I want to do those to show you the funny, you know, trippy contrails for the spaceship, playing the game with big head mode, playing the game where enemies have big, he uh, big head mode, all that kind of crazy stuff. If I want to do that, I can do that in my off time, off camera, to show that to you. You know, and then just sort of start up a video where it's already all unlocked because I've done it off camera. You know, that's probably the better option. Sabotage the thungs, th thungs, thugs for less jamming away. Ooh, we've been recording for a while now. I don't want to put it into two episodes, though. I think we're about to do a spaceship thing. 
To disable the jamming array, destroy the six transponders. You got it. Now I'm gonna need to clear them. Cause I know Expose transmitters with the bolt crank. Press square to attach your wrench, then walk around the platform. Yes. So I bring them up. Hit the exposed rods to destroy the towers. Beautiful. Oh, sh I don't want to interrupt the help message, but I accidentally interrupted it by freaking switching weapons. Monster. Ooh, that's right. This game comes with a monsterpedia. I forgot all about that. Uh, destroy transponders. Bolt crank. Destroy transponders. Use map, really? Okay. Oh, I can't play it? I was going to play the one that I skipped by accident. Weapons, gadgets, ship. Oh, man. I'll look at all that later on. And let me know if you want to see the Monsterpedia. It's freaking cool. It gives you stats on each one of them as well. Including all of the monster that you fa all of the monsters that you face in the arena. And any of the boss monsters. And you can just collect them all. Like Pokemon. Oof. I should not have used such a powerful weapon on that. That was a waste of ammunition. My bad. All right, we're continuing with the satellite. Can I break these things? Should I? Okay, I'm gonna strafe for this whole level. Come and get me. Come and get me, little fellas. Gotta make sure that this area is clear when I get on the bolt crank, because if I get on the bolt crank and the area is not clear, then I'll be a sitting duck for attacks, and we don't want that. Nice! Okay, I only have to shoot it once in order to get it to start up. Ooh, the dark side of the moon. Why is it dark? Because lava! Actually, that's not even lava. That's like... Um... Oh, I move slower when I strafe, don't I? Eh, well, I won't strafe all the time then. Anyway, those are like heating vents or coils or something. Man, this planet's cool. Oh, and if I jump here, it'll take me somewhere else, but I want to go across these platforms first. This is a neat little level stage part. Uh-oh! It's okay, they're melee. If they're melee, I can take them out with melee. We can... Oh, hello. You missed me. And I want to be careful, because if I... Yeah, see, if I accidentally activate the bolt crank while the enemies are still there, while I'm trying to smack the enemies, I'll wind up activating the bolt crank, and I'll be stuck on it while the enemies are smacking me. So to save ammo, all I have to do is... That. Yes. And these levels are so cool and so original. Look at all this. This is just great. Just great. Flippin' amazing. Uh, that's probably why one of the uh, things was how to activate your map. For a massive jump, stand on the blast pad and press X. Bing! I will. Woo! Oh, okay, we need to go up there. Also, another way you can find the transponders, I believe, is to follow these coils. Because those are the appear to be the power sources for them. What? Who hit me? Did he get a hit? I guess he got a hit. Oh, lucky him. Oh, yeah! Gravity bomb. Can I actually... Oh, please let it land there and explode. Dang it, I don't see it. I wanted, I wanted to see it land there and just blow all of them to kingdom come. So that brings you back to the platinum form. You, oh, God, there's so many... Oh, God. Now it's getting a little bit complex. Oh, hello, there's another thingy. Come and get me. Oh, nope, nope, nope. I want to stay on this one, please. Because that's got the, the bolt crank that I need. Thank you. So we're, oh, we're exposing that one, which we want to go back there using this one. Okay. Oh, hang on, this would be cool. Is it going to hit? I think it went over. Okay, two transponders remaining. This one takes us over. Actually, we can pick whatever direction we want now that I think about it. Oh, we're gonna miss it. Oh, thank God there's no fall damage. Boing! Oh, hello. Okay, we wanted to activate that one, expose it. So we want to get to the bolt, which is here. <laughs> they want to get to me so bad, but they can't. Look at them shaking their fists, going, come on over here. You get the chopper. 
you get to chop up. What? Really? Ratchet, it's right there. <laughs> it destroys them if you hit them with it. That's awesome. So we need another bouncy pad thing, don't we? Where's the last? Oh, well, and I fell. Dag nabbit. Get a hit on me. Nope. Okay, they didn't. Oh, you lucky. Whatever. <laughs> All right. You get to chop a. Huh, really? Manual aim, maybe? Come on. Why did Choppa go? Why did, why did Choppa fall down? Oh, and it doesn't retarget to him. Well, whatever. Something something about the leveling. We got it now. Beautiful. Good work, my boy. You are proving to be invaluable in this underwear. Anywho, it appears the thief is now under the protection of thugs for less. But I may have found a way for you to insinuate their operation. Is it dangerous? <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, well, uh, actually, yes, it is. Good. Take a look at this. The wind in your hair. The sun on your skin, the bugs in your teeth. We are the Desert Riders. Before I became a Desert Rider, I didn't fit in any worse. I had low self-esteem, bad breath, and a thing for ladies' undergarments. <laughs> but these guys understand me. They really do. Yeah, I'm just here for the bake sales. <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah, I also make these cute gloves for all the guys. So if you've got what it takes, use this temporary membership to enter the most grueling hoverbike race in the galaxy. Win it and become one of us. Desert Riders, the number one leisure choice of thugs for less. Desert Riders all use Megacorp bikes, so I just had to pull a few strings. Contract me as soon as you get more indignation. Fizz Widget, out. Nice. Now that's an episode. I wish I could have shown you uh, the fight against Chainblade, though. Like, Chainblade and, uh, the, god, I don't even know his name, the Brain Dude. But, yeah, though, those will have to be in separate episodes. Because this one's definitely running on very long. We're at, like, what, um, 40, oh god, 51 minutes, okay. <laughs> I was looking at the live record time instead of the actual record time, and it said zero, and I was like, no! But yeah, we're at 50 minutes, so I'm going to have to try to shorten this down. I could probably do it by eliminating a lot of the, um... Oh! Dang it, I thought he was going to fire the, the minions. He did not fire the minions. Anyway, uh, we could probably do it by shortening down all the time I spent gambling. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, that's all the time and more I have left for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, if you did, leave, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated, and until next time, take it easy, my friends.